Hello, I'm Ernie Askeville, and you're watching my YouTube channel, Technologist on the Go. In this video, you're going to see me once again putting the iPad Pro M1 in action. I need to test some monitors um, because I'm going to be putting them back into service. I'm not sure which ones are good, but you'll see how wonderful it is to do that using the feature uh, that the uh, the M1 based iPads have that they truly support an external monitor the same way a laptop and PC would, okay? Okay, I'm testing monitors right now. Um, monitors that otherwise would be discarded. And I got my iPad. This is the uh, 2021 M1 model. And I've got a, uh, a USB-C to display port adapter. So I'm going to go ahead and connect that a display port cable with me. Get plugged in on one end. And I'm going to plug it in on the other one. And there we go. With the M1, uh, iPad M1, unlike the previous model, the 2018 model that allowed you to connect an external display, you are forced into mirroring that. Uh, as you can see now, you are no longer bound that way. You can have anything else on that. You can truly use it as an external monitor, not just a mirror of your primary monitor. And um, there you go. There really isn't much to it, is there? Phenomenal, fantastic. You get so much laptop-like functionality in it that you only need to invoke your laptop when you absolutely need to, as it is that the iPad can do about 20, as you were, 80% of what a laptop does, or slightly more. Thank you very much for watching my channel. Please like and subscribe.